Welcome back students. I am here to discuss the solutions of the questions which were given to you after the completion of lecture number 2. This is class 6 science chapter 2 components of food. First two questions were multiple choice questions. Let us go through them quickly. Question number one. Which one of the following food item does not provide dietary fiber? Option A, whole grains. Option B, whole pulses. Option C, fruits and vegetables. And option D, milk. If you recollect what we learnt about roughage, you can very easily note down that milk is the only food item which does not provide dietary fiber out of the four food items. Whole grains, whole pulses, Fruits and vegetables do provide dietary fiber and helps in proper functioning of our digestive system. So, option D, milk is the correct answer. Question number 2. Which of the following nutrients is not present in Milk. Option A. Proteins. Option B. Vitamin C. Option C. Calcium. Option D. Vitamin D. Out of all these options, protein, calcium and vitamin D is present in milk. However, it lacks vitamin C. This makes our correct answer option B vitamin C. Generally, the substances that have sour taste are the ones which are rich sources of vitamin C. However, we know milk is not sour in taste. Mark my words here, once the milk is converted into curd, it do develop the soreness. Question number 3. Deficiency diseases can be prevented by taking a dash. If you have guessed your answer as balanced diet, then you are absolutely right. A diet which contains proper amount of all the nutrients which are required by our body is called the balanced diet. If a person is taking correct proportion of all the nutrients, then ultimately he will be safe and will not suffer from any of the deficiency diseases. Question number 4. Egg yolk is rich in dash and egg albumin is rich in dash. To answer this question, you need to look at the parts of egg. The white portion of the egg is known as egg white, whereas the yellow portion is commonly known as yolk. If you see carefully in the diagram, it is shown under the egg nutrient section that the yolk is highly rich in fat whereas the egg white 
or egg albumin is rich in proteins. Hence, egg yolk is rich in fats, whereas egg albumin is rich in proteins. Question number 5. Write two examples of food items which are A. Energy giving B. Bodybuilding C. Protective Answer Energy giving food items are wheat and ghee. Because you all know energy giving food includes both carbohydrate as well as fat rich food items. B. Bodybuilding The examples of food items are pulses and meat. C. Protective Here Whole grains and fruits are the examples which are having the good amount of vitamins and minerals. Question 